Good morning, my beautiful internet people. I am the kid without a slingshot, Dennis the Menace, back doing that sketchy old thing again while we ride the motorcycle. Welcome to my local commune here in old uh, business town. truck action. Yeah, so welcome to my local commune. This is uh, my daily trip. It's about 27 minutes long. It's usually early in the morning, which isn't too bad. But this is one of the reasons why I ride this bike. It's got a great maneuverability. It's loud enough to where it can be heard. It's nice and flashy. And then I learned the most on this ride than I do on any other ride. Any group ride I've taken, any random ride that I go on, just because of the influx in traffic and the amount of people that are on the go. I typically take a specific route all the time to work. The route's pretty much the same either way I take it, um, except for around a few lights. But I really wish they would legalize lane splitting. I did some in the past when I was early moto vlogging, but I kind of knocked off on some of that just because of local law enforcement cracking down. We're gonna take a little righty dewey right here. So yeah, you just take a little quick little slappity slap over here. You let traffic kind of do its thing. While it's doing its thing, you check traffic both ways. You put your indicator to turn left, you go left. Then you put your indicator to turn back right and you go right, just like so. And then we're back in business. If you're coming over the channel for the first time and you're skeptical about what's gonna take place on the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button in the top right hand corner of the Dennis DeMinis channel and hit a little bell so you can get notifications on the 10 out of 10 motor vlogs that I'm gonna give you. Hopefully it's another really good year for uh, for YouTube in general and I hope that motor vlogging continues to grow as well. It's something that has grown great in like the first couple of years but isn't growing so great now. So yeah, I work for a local resort here. It's a five star five diamond resort. We do a lot of things there. I'm particularly in one department that uh, uh, you know, helps out the old bootlegging process, if you know what I mean. Got to pull my visor up here. That's what I mean right there, is just daily traffic, ladies and gentlemen. And to be able to get in and out of traffic like that, I'm caught up between four cars. One car, two cars up is trying to get over in the right-hand lane. All right, this beautiful lights, one of those great lights that I like to take on different scenarios for example it's a green arrow now it's fixing to change to a red it'll go yellow and then red this light will stay green i can bust a yui down here i might make it we'll see yellow right now Okay, that was a little squirrely back there. Shit gets weird sometimes, you know what I mean? So this is the beautiful causeway, which is where most of the traffic is kind of contained in my route. The speeds are a little bit higher. People pay less attention. It's really uh, fun on a motorcycle. I try to maintain my lane. I try to indicate. Um, if I have somebody that's gonna get over on me, I usually always indicate and then beat my horns another trick, but a little skip, jump, and a hop is sometimes what it takes to get in and out of traffic. And this is the beautiful thing about riding a bike. Like I said, the commune is just incredibly awesome. Absolutely freaking BEA beautiful. This is the reason I ride. This motorcycle. Well, she just flicked me the bird. Gotta love it. What's a Ducati uh, Monster 796 for on a daily commune? Is it to be like your grandpa and uh, kind of like put your false teeth in and say, well, Sonny Jim, I think I'm just gonna keep it at a clean 60. Nah, Dennis, Dennis ain't about that life. 
I try to make calculated decisions, but at the same time, somebody will look at this and say, man, you are absolutely crazy. So I just thought I'd bring you guys along on a little short video with Dennis the Menace on his commune to work, his daily commune. More videos are coming. The, the setup tutorial on the HJC for my GoPro Hero 7 and Cena setup. Also, a special shout out to a girl and her bike. I'll put the link down in the description for her elbow on curved sport bike helmets. If you're having an issue with your GoPro attachments not sticking to a flat surface on your motorcycle and you need some help on getting a good angle, a good clean angle to the center of the helmet, she makes curved elbows. She also includes screws and she's got a great website for it. Like I said, I'll put it in the link in the description. This has been Dennis the Menace, the crazy kid without the slingshot. Good bike. Have a good morning.